Since introducing its Bachelor of Medicine, Bachelor of Surgery, MBBS program, Divano University has been heavily criticized with claims it was rushed and lacks quality. However, Dr. Malau has brushed aside critics calling for support on this program to help address the human resource crisis, especially with shortage of doctors in the country. Who will determine the market forces for supply of people, quality people out there? So I'm really 100% certain that in 10 or 20 years, everyone will be running around wanting to see a doctor. Shall we have the doctors out there ready for them? I think I really ask our colleagues, whoever they are, to be a bit more open-minded and please work with us. Dr. Malau said Ivano University has the right values and is committed to quality and standards. With the necessary infrastructure, this will help provide healthcare professionals with the heart to serve. First for as a contribution to the country's development, we want to meaningfully participate in the country's development. For us, it's a health sector we want to support. I, I really think those are the main ingredients and commitments the university has to contribute to nation building. It took Divine University 10 years to establish this MBBS program, partnering with the National Health Department, Medical Board of PNG, and other stakeholders like Prairie Court to University School of Medicine, one of the oldest medical schools in the world to deliver a quality outcome. He said the MBBS program is being offered in line with World Federation for Medical Education Standards. Something that is new. Th that's true, what I mentioned. We are at the beginning of the path. We are building capacity. We don't have all human resources or infrastructure in place yet. But we have planned for that and we are actively working to implement this plan and to make sure that our graduates have required capacity. The first batches of 29 students have been enrolled in the MBBS program. Fabian Hakelitz, National MTV News.